and a great episode of your podcast, Akimbo, where you talk about placebo effects and the nocebo effect. What are we getting right about placebo effects? What are we getting wrong? And how do we incorporate them into our lives? Placebos get no respect for a reason I cannot understand. We know that for many physical ailments, 33 to 70% of our ability to get better is the placebo effect in our head. In whatever area it is, physical fitness, being a musician, it is much more likely you will get better. So where do we go with that? If you want to develop a better practice, figuring out how to find placebos that work for you and create the conditions for them to work, like this office we're sitting in, it exists so that when I walk in here, I feel different. It's a placebo. It makes my work better. A nocebo is a placebo that makes us worse. And we are surrounded by nocebos. We're surrounded by inputs that end up ruining our day. And so if you're a creator, if you're someone who's doing a certain kind of work, or you want your health to get better, figure out where the nocebos are and get rid of them. 